Hello there, all you beautiful thrill seekers. My name is Coach Shadow the Born Bob Bill for Theme Parks, and welcome to a Theme Park News from Update where today we're going to be looking at Aquaman Power Wave. This is the uh, new coaster coming to Six Flags Over Texas, and. and. a little thing came out over the, over the evening, and. It seems like potentially this could now open in 2022. So we're going to explain uh, where I've seen this, uh, how I've seen this, why this could happen, uh, and share my thoughts on it. So before we get started, guys, make sure you like the video if you loved it, comment down below your thoughts and opinions, subscribe to the channel, click the notification bell so you never miss another video. Also, guys, use the description down below to submit your video ideas using the Google Forms link. They've all been saved so far, so we're still waiting for some new video suggestions. So please send your ideas in. They will get noted down straight away. Uh, also, guys, make sure you are following the Twitter, the TikTok, the Instagram, and the Snapchat. Also linked in the description. Also, guys, get your comments in as well as your questions for the 2K sub Q&A, which has been filmed the day before Christmas Eve, and it's been re released on Christmas Eve. Use the hashtag question before or after your question. And for now, guys, let's have a look exactly what's going on with Aquaman Power Wave at Six Flags Over Texas. So seemingly, it is likely that this is set to be delayed till 2022, according to the official Six Flags Over Texas website. Now, there is an argument on both sides. Because looking at the actual website, it does say uh, special features goes upside down. Uh, now, obviously, that raised a few questions, first of all. It raised a lot of questions as to, are they actually adding the loop as part of the, the looping um, power splash concept by Mac Rides? Then I looked further down the website. They spelled Mac Rides on the website as M-A-C-H. So... You know, it's not exactly uh, the biggest change. It could, it might not be a realistic change. You never know. But, you know, if they're spelling Mac rides like that, then I have a feeling that it won't go upside down and it will be just delayed till 2022. And I think that this is a, a sensible decision. I think this is an interesting decision. And I'm going to share my thoughts about why I think this right about now. So, of course, even if the website is saying 2022 now, we have to be certain. And now, there's no official confirmation, which is why the title of this video is a rhetorical question. Um, you know, is, is Aquaman Power Wave going to be opening for the 2022 season? You know, that is the question we're answering with this video. You know, what's going to happen? What is going to happen? It should be interesting. Now, obviously, Aquaman Power Wave was still scheduled to open in 2021. However... With the likelihood of 2022, it does raise into question what exactly they're going to do to make it go under construction for another year. And you do worry if they are going to put the upside down feature on, but they've just misspelled Mac Rides in the website. Obviously, you can't 100% be certain and you can't 100% believe exactly what's been said on the website, especially when they're spelling the manufacturer's name wrong. You know, it's a little mistake, but, you know, one they can fix in time. But obviously, you know, you do raise some questions whether it is going to go upside down and whether it is going to, you know, do what the special feature says on the website. You know, are they lying on the website? We'll have to sort of double check with that. But I think if it is going to go upside down, I think that would explain the, the sort of uh, the year delay, should we say. Because it was scheduled to open in 2020, then of course with COVID, it's now opening in 2021. And now there's questions whether it could open in 2022. And I also put down 2022 being the year, potentially to what else is going on with the Six Flags Parks. Because if you look exactly what's going on at other Six Flags Parks, Magic Mountain is opening their proposed RMC Raptor in 2022 now. So, are they delaying Power Wave? Are they adding some stuff to it and making it better? Maybe, you know, there was rumours about no turntable, because obviously with the budget and everything, uh, you know, are they making little changes here and there, but not wholesale changes? You know, they might not add the turntable or the loops. So they might be lying about the upside down feature. Uh, unless maybe one of the spikes at either end goes beyond 90 degrees. You never know. Uh, it's a very Six Flags thing we know in the enthusiast community that could make the simplest things, you know, a record. Um, so they might say that this spike goes beyond 90 degrees and that's called an upside down feature technically, even though we all kind of know it's not. So are they going to go upside down a little bit, just a teensy wincy little bit on one of the spikes? You never know. Um, so, you know, there's loads of questions still being raised. I'm sure that, you know, Six Flags Over Texas will... 
probably release an official statement at some point and we'll share some information to confirm exactly what's happening but for now at least it's still 2021 opening but there's questions over 2022 but again linking back to magic mountain with the proposed rmc raptor going to 2022 uh in the tidal wave green lantern first flight sites uh in that year you know you look at what they're doing there and I think that, you know, you do have to answer, in my opinion, you know, that this could be a 2022 ride because they want to open it along with things like the Magic Mountain Raptor. Um, obviously, they're probably not going to mention it on the new rides announcement video next year when it comes around to August again. Um, but it is going to be interesting to see what they do about the 2022 season alongside possibly Power Wave and the Magic Mountain Raptor. So, Six Flags Over Texas really is a debate here. It's really an interesting scenario, whether it's 50-50, whether it's going to be 2021 or 2022. However, it should be interesting to see which way they're going to go officially. But it is just a question at this moment. It is mentioned on the website as 2022. However, with the sp misspelling of the manufacturer and the goes upside down feature mentioned on the description of the website, it raises a lot of questions whether it is going to be 2022 or not. So... Thank you very much, guys, for watching this video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. And for now, guys, my name is Coach Shall Keep them the Coast Life. And I'll see you guys next video very, very soon. Take care, guys. Have an aquamantastic day.